thousands demanded a meeting with Ontario Premier Doug Ford. Formed by multiple Indigenous groups earlier this year, members of the First Nations Land Defence Alliance marched to the provincial legislature to stop mining development on their lands in northern Ontario. It's important for us as Indigenous people because it's our way of life. At issue, this crescent-shaped deposit, discovered in 2007 in Treaty 9 territory. Home to more than a dozen First Nations, it contains minerals like lithium, crucial to electric vehicle batteries, smartphones and laptops. We want to block all the traffic. Some here say the province is granting mining claims without their consent in an effort to jumpstart a billion-dollar industry. Each community of First Nations is entitled to their own uh, opinions and to their own affairs. But we're saying that we don't want mining in, in our traditional territory. Ontario's Indigenous Affairs Minister says while he appreciates their position, there are other First Nations in the region who want development. These are communities who see this as a progressive opportunity to create a new path forward to prosperity improve the infrastructure in their communities, ensure that their young people have opportunities. Chief Chris Munez says his community is not against development, but his people must be a part of the process. We're a pro-development community, but consultation, accommodation has to be done in a way that we understand. Members of the First Nations Land Defense Alliance say they want a halt to mining exploration on their traditional lands and they want to meet with the Premier face to face. They also warn they'll set up blockades if mining projects move ahead. Idil Moussa, CBC News, Toronto.